If you're ever wearing handcuffs, call 1-800-NO-CUFFS. Well, the first thing is when somebody's arrested, before they can get out of jail, they've got to go through the booking process. So that involves usually getting photos taken, fingerprints, and those fingerprints have to go up to Sacramento so a background check can be done. Obviously, law enforcement doesn't want to release people who may be wanted on a murder warrant or something like that. At that point, there's a few ways that somebody can gain their release. They'll either be cited out, just given a notice to appear in court if it's a relatively minor offense. Depending on where this happens, you could get that experience with a petty theft, with a first offense DUI case, uh, certainly with traffic infractions, things like that. You just get a date to appear in court. They give you something that looks like a ticket. For a more serious offense, there may be a bail that has to get posted. And every county is different, but every county will have a published bail schedule that's going to list every single crime there is and the amount of what's called presumptively reasonable bail that should apply. So at that point, it's up to the person or their friends and loved ones to either post the cash amount of bail or to use a bail bondsman. And how this plays out is going to be very different depending on which choice somebody makes. I think that's better reserved for uh, another video. Um, the other opportunity, if somebody doesn't get released, either on their own recognizance or being cited out or by posting bail, then they'll be brought to court, generally speaking, within 48 hours. At that point, uh, the judge may choose to release them. The attorneys can argue about whether bail should be increased or decreased. If the person gets released, they're out and they get to fight their case from out of custody. Otherwise, they're going to be in custody and they'll have to fight their case from the inside. If you're ever wearing handcuffs, call 1-800-NO-CUFFS. And remember, if police want to talk to you, you want to talk to us first. Call 1-800-NO-CUFFS.